Good morning everyone. Our project is facial detection using deep learning and I am Varsha from final year CSE department and our team members are Nishwil ma'am and Saundarya and our guide is Mrs. S. Jayanti ma'am, assistant professor in department of computer science and engineering, Agni College of Technology. And first uh, aim and objectives of our project, classification and detection of objects are main area in the computer vision. In our proposed system, it is able to detect whether the person is wearing the face mask or not with greater accuracy and robustness. Next, we're gonna see the problem of our project. As we all know, we are in a pandemic COVID-19 situation. To reduce the spread of this coronavirus, we have to protect ourselves by wearing a face mask. It makes a face recognition a very difficult task. That's why this project aims to provide a human recognition with a face mask and it will be helpful in various applications at public places, schools, parks where we need to be detected despite wearing a face mask. Next we see about the literature survey of our project. First is retinal face mask detector. The year of publication is 2020. Uh, the ResNet and MobileNet is used to as a backbone. Next, performance evaluation of intelligent face mask detection system with the various deep learning classifier. The year of publication is 2020. It's used as a mobile net and a VGG. Next, inference from literature survey. Uh, it's used as eye closure ratio as an input parameter for detection. If the eye closure decreases from the standard ratio and it's alerted, Pi camera is used to, to capture the images using Raspberry Pi. Next, disadvantages of Raspberry Pi. Even though Raspberry Pi can perform a different task, and have some limitations someone common like uh, windows linux are not compatible some application which high require high demand on cpu processing user must not use the normal computer to judge the raspberry pi okay next we're gonna see the proposed system of our project as we all know deep learning has created a significant improvement in classification and object detection deep learning which is also known as deep structured learning or hierarchical learning or a convolutional neural network. We done project based on a convolutional neural network. The convolutional layers helpful in extract the exact features from the image for a recognition and it will be helpful for the detection of whether the person is wearing a face mask or not through the extracted features. Next we are going to see the architecture of our project and first it will initialize the video or the webcam and it will extract the image from the frames and it will load face detection model by using the CNN algorithm and it will uh, extract the fa face images and it will apply the image pre-processing and it will load face mask detection model and it convert the result into the video frame and then it will display the box identification with a face uh, whether the person is wearing the face mask or not. Next, we are going to see the data set of our project. Data set is a consist of a set of digital photographs. It is used to test, train and evaluate the performance of the algorithm. And in our project, we use approximately 7,983 masked images and 7,689 non-masked images. And next, we are going to see the models of our project. And first, it's a resize. Resize means changing the image size without changing the amount of data in that image. That means changing the physical size of an image without changing the pixel dimension. No data can be added or removed from that image. And next, it is a contrast enhancement. It is a process of improving the quality of an image and information content of the data. And it will make the image features more clearly by use of the colors. Next we see about the result and analysis. We have tested so many number of images and then we found that uh, then we found that accuracy level of our RCN and classifier is much better. It classifies each images. Uh, it leads to a greater accuracy even with a massive computation. Then we are ne next output of our project mask and without mask. Yeah, our college, Agni College of Technology has provided various classes and trainings for our project development and as well as they provide classes for our domain related and it will be helpful for uh, building our project as well as to grow my career knowledge. Next we're gonna see the conclusion and future work and we all know artificial intelligence and machine learning has developed various methods for the face mask detection but now we just discussed about the various methods for the detection Nowadays, face mask detection is a very challenging task. 
that's why it aims to provide the application for the prevention of spreading of coronavirus and identifying criminals anti spoofing tracking etc by using this deep convolutional neural network we can easily detect the face mask whether the person is wearing a face mask or not with a higher accuracy and robustness and these are some of the references we have collected from various journals for our project and these are the details about our journal publication and thank you so much and our final output is whether the person is wearing a mask it will show with mask and whether the person is not wearing the mask it will show no mask